The coolest thing about my job is you get to make lots of maps. The history of cartography goes way back, and when you think of the first people who want to map their own surroundings, it has really developed through technology to where it is today. Cartography can include all stages of map making, right from collecting information about the earth, compiling information, putting it together, analyzing the geography, and then finally publishing a map, which is our specialty. We think of three big disciplines within the field. One is GIS, which is the information of an analytical cartography. Another is the design aspect, where you actually understand how to portray symbols to people, the user. And lastly, the CAD portion, which is used in a lot of automated processes. The creativity in cartography is the thing that really uh, appealed to me when I was younger. And as I learned a lot about geography, I understood that if you can be creative in the field and use technology that you enjoy, it really becomes a career choice. My favorite project was working for the Historic Atlas of Canada, where a team of 11 cartographers worked together to create three volume set of the history of settlement in Canada. Uh, as a cartographer, you might be able to go out and work for the Canadian Hydrographic Service, capture information about the seafloor and map it in your office. Another career that you might consider in cartography is to work for Parks Canada where you could team up with a scientist and learn things about the environment in the park and map it. Cartography has been around for a long time and you think of cartography and how it's evolved with technology. The future is really great for this field. If you're really creative and have a personality that likes geography and are interested in computers, this might be the field for you. My biggest advice for you is to don't let your mom or your dad pick your career. Don't go somewhere just because your friends are going there. Pick something you really love.